Hello everyone, my name is Kamikaze right now, bringing another video on Family Simulator 2015. Today we're going to be reviewing this awesome F450 Power Stroke mod that I found. As you can see, this thing is massively lifted on huge, looks like at least 30, I want to say at least 35, it's probably like 36, 37 inch tires. Um, but really cool, got some nice rims on it. But um, I'm going to be towing this fire truck as well, so should be a fun episode today. But, um, got a little dirty, you know, towing the trailer around in the truck first. Um, mm -hmm. so, definitely, uh, definitely going to be a good time. So, here, let's, um, let's hook this thing up and see what we can do. Oh, wait. Here, let me back this off because this is really heavy. Let's see, here, I can wait for this thing to start up. But, um, yeah, I'm gonna back this thing up. I think I can tilt it in. There we go. Oh, not too far. There we go. I like that. It should be good. Make a little seesaw. Come on. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Um, I, I have to say, though, I was kind of surprised with this truck. <clears throat> because, as you can see, it does have the, um... It has all like the extra, um, um, what is it? it has all the extra like, um, what are they called? Excuse me, forget to hear me. I'm doing my chainsaw. <laughs> um, like track bars and whatnot. See, excuse me, drawing a blank there. Um, it does have like all the track bars and shit and whatnot underneath there. It also has bump stops and um. So it's pretty interesting. It's really, it would look to me like a really heavy hauler, but it isn't too much of a heavy hauler. And you will see when I load this truck on here why it's not. Um, come on now. We'll just move the uh, truck. That's one of the things I don't like about this. These fire trucks that their bumpers on the front always have so much collision on them. Um, let's see. Actually, you know what? If I spin this around, it'll be better. But I mean, overall, I really like this truck. I think it looks amazing. It's got lights, not all the regular lights and everything like that. So, really pretty cool. I like it a lot. And, um, let's just see if we can pull it up on the uh, top here, and then I won't have to worry about the uh, collision oh, for the uh, bumper of the trailer. But overall, this is one of my favorite fire trucks. This one and the uh, other one over there. Yeah, like the tanker truck. Here. My two favorites, personally. Okay. Now, as you can see, the truck sags. It can um, um, and then as you can see, it's, uh, I mean, I, I was amazed the wheels go that far up. I don't understand the physics of how the axle stays down, but the wheels go up. That makes, like, not too much sense to me. But, anyway. It's, um, overall really good truck. I like it. It's a, a fun truck to use. Here, I'll show you guys the power specs when we're going up this hill. Um, plenty powerful truck, you know. 6.7, so 6.7 for it, I think, pushes like 900 something to follow the torque and stuff. So, okay, 3, 2, 1, and go. 
So as you can see, pretty good start off, nothing too bad. It um yeah, it has decent power. So not not a bad truck, I like it. Oh shit, and of course we hit the tractor, son of a bitch. Alright, well here I'll redo that. So um get a little bit of a more accurate test. Um, but um, overall, not a really bad truck. It's just kind of handles a little bit wonky because you got the uh, like ascent to the ground, <laughs> so just kind of handles weird. Um, but um, I don't know. I mean, overall, I really like this truck. I think it's a really nice, good-looking truck. And, uh, I mean, besides the fact that it sags pretty good, which is alright. It's not a deal-breaker. It's just more, you know, it sags down low. Anyway, here, let's do a little test here. As you can see, plenty of power. Um, plenty of torque. You can pull the trailer right up the hill from here, which most trucks can't even do now. Um, yeah. But, um, yeah, so, overall, really nice truck, um, interior is pretty good. It's, uh, I don't know, a little bit, like, a little bit rough, I guess I would say a little tiny bit. Whoa, shit. Oh, this is what I get for not paying attention to my job. <laughs> but, um, <coughs> so, overall, I'd probably give this truck a, um, I'd say a four- I have like a 4.5 out of 5. Um, 0.5 being maybe the interior, the interior being a little rough, and the back end not being able to haul too much, even though it does say it's a 450, so it should be able to haul. I think it's a ton and a quarter, or a ton and a half. I can't, I cannot remember exactly, but so just um, wanted to bring you guys another video. I um, I have to see what other mods I want to do. I um I'm slowly going through the whole site at BNB. I'm just trying to you know just go through everything and make sure I cover every single mod that I they've got. I mean I think I've gone through most of them, but I just want to be sure. Um so if you guys have any like uh, comments or um, questions or if you want any specific mod review, just uh, feel free to comment below and uh, let me know, and I'll make sure to uh, you know review the mod for you. I, um, oh yeah, I do have to, I have, I'll do this with mod in, in the next, um, video. I, uh, I forgot to do that. I, just, I, I have so much going on right now, I just, um, you know, when I get time to actually sit down and do this, sometimes I, uh, just, you know, <laughs> I forget, like, what I said I was going to do, and then I, I go off and do other stuff. But, I mean, overall, this truck isn't a bad truck at all. So, definitely, like, not a, um... Not a bad truck to do, or not a truck to waste time on, because this truck is really nice, and it does haul well. Um, so I can't complain. But, anyway, um, I will see you guys in the next video. I will see... I don't know if I'm going to do this monster truck in the next video. I have to see what map I want to do it on, and what I want to do with it, per se. But, um, there's going to be some crazy stuff going on with that, just letting you guys know. So, anyway... Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, guys. I hope to see you in the next video. Um, just thank you guys for all the, uh, you know, likes, comments, support, and everything you guys have, you know, been doing. I really appreciate it. But, um, anyway, guys, I'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.